Hi, my name's Simon from Motordrome. Now, today we're going to take a walk around and a drive off this uh, rather nice uh, R registration, so either 97 or 98, Defender 130, uh, Pulse Ambulance, Camper Conversion, you can see behind me here. Uh, actually, we're going to do three videos on this one um, walk around the outside, video of the inside, and driving video as well. So, hope you like them. Okay, let's take a walk around this uh, R registration. So either 1997 or 1998, Defender 130 Pulse Ambulance Camper Conversion um, with the 300 TDI engine as it would have had originally. Uh, total conversion by Overland Campers and it has been used by them as a camper hire vehicle. So, uh, so you know it's gonna be good if it's a hire one. Um, X Gulf War II, I think, and it has got They've all been sealed from the inside, but it has got a fair amount of battle damage on it. Up here, some bullet holes down here. And so they have all been sealed from the inside though, apparently. Um, looks like it's taken some small arms fire over the years. But as I say, now, now retired and used as, used as a camper. Um, we'll just take a slow walk around it first of all. can't get it all in <laughs> but it's really quite impressive the conversion overland campers have did four or five of these uh, all the same internally and you can we'll, we'll post a link on our website to, to their video about uh, the instructions for them and things which probably tells you a lot more than I can tell you about it obviously it's got uh, pop roof on it um, it's got uh, ARB touring awning uh, it's basically got everything for, for off-grid and overland, uh, overland camping. Um, obviously the paint is to military standard, so don't expect an absolutely super shiny vehicle. There's a few dinks in the near side front wing there, but as I say, it's an ex-military vehicle that uh, has been fired on. Let's see what it's like up along there. Proper heavy duty wolf style wheels on it show you underneath there. It will be coming with a fresh 12 months MOT incidentally. Inside in the front it's all as it should be. Three seats across the front so in total you've got belted seats for five people um, and I suppose really it's four berth. Uh, it's got a modern stereo system in it and that's a reversing camera there. Uh, you can see through to the um, to what used to be the, the area for stretchers down there. And then carrying on round, obviously caravan style split door here. Um, step, which does retract. Show you underneath here. And then around the back, obviously the rear doors do open uh, they have got security lock on them though. View under the tail end. And then down the offside. Night heater stuff there. Bit more battle damage. No, very characterful this one. As I say, properly prepared for all the right sort of um, off-roading off and, and um, off-grid camping. Right, uh, we'll do another video, I think, of the inside. Do that uh, separately to break them up a little bit. But um, there you go in terms of uh, its outside.